September the 1st. Beautiful sunny weather. Very breezy. Getting ready for a storm to come in by Saturday. Looky, looky, it's September 1st, Thursday evening, probably 6.45ish, and they decided to chemtrail again. The chemtrails before the storm. Whoopie doo. Yes, they think we're blind. Boy, that is some pretty clouds before the storm. Chemtrails just spread and spread and spread and spread. And this is facing southwest, give or take. I think I'll just stay outside a little longer and check if we have any more little flybys. Preliminary feeder bands and chemtrails. Sun seems to be setting more in the west lately. Hmm, maybe the earth is doing a wobble? Chemtrails, chemtrails, chemtrails. Good or evil? Sure does mess up a beautiful blue sky. But even though it's windy, we can actually see the moon tonight. Crescent moon. September 2nd, 2011. Sunrise in Cajun country. And also the storm clouds beginning to head our way with the tropical storm in the Gulf of Mexico. And my cat, Kitty Angel, browsing around, trying to catch hummingbirds. Friday, September the 2nd. Gusty winds, light rain from Tropical Storm Lee.
Saturday morning, September the 3rd. Yes, we're getting all the gale winds of Tropical Storm Leap. It's been gusty and rainy all night and all morning. It is close to 7 a.m., so we've got a long way to go. Tropical Storm Lee. It's Saturday morning, September the 3rd, and we've just gotten some large rain bands in. It's still lightly raining. The winds are still gusty. Uh, the storm is about 20 to 25 miles south of me. And what a gorgeous Saturday morning. with this system, how um, in the higher cloud top you can see with those colored bands that you see, and that's just an indication of what we are looking at here with the heavy rain showers throughout the region. And you can see that center of circulation just south of Morgan Sea continuing to move its way northward very slowly once again at about seven miles an hour. So quite a bit of cloudy conditions out there this afternoon, I mean this morning, and we'll expect much the same this afternoon. Now bear with me here as um, our information has just up have updated um, and have actually gained some strength um, within the last three hours of sustaining winds of 60 miles an hour. Now gusts up higher than that, possibly 65, and I know it's not reading on our um, current stats, but that is a possibility. Now by the time we get into this afternoon, once again, continuing to see 60 mile an hour winds as it does continue to make landfall as we head into the next 12 hours by the time we head into this afternoon.